So our last test is Biorets. And let's first talk a little bit about the Biorret reagent. Notice also it has a similar blue color to what we saw with the Benedix. Just as with the Benedix, Biorets also has free copper ions. And we're going to use those ions to help us detect the presence of protein in solution. So, so far we have tested our reducing sugars, which is a carbohydrate, our starch, which is a carbohydrate, and our fats and oils, which are our lipids. Finally, we're going to look at our proteins. And remember that proteins are defined by what they are composed of. These are molecules who are made of these units we call amino acids. And these amino acids are put together through these things called peptide bonds. Peptide bonds is unique to proteins. It's something you will not see in carbohydrates, in fats and oils, or any of the other biological molecules. So we're going to use that distinctive characteristic of a protein, the peptide bond, to identify its presence in solution. So just as in the previous stations, we took two mils of our solution, added it to a test tube, and then we add two mils of our respective reagent. For biorets, what we're looking for again is a color change. In this particular case, if I have a protein present in solution, I should see a light purple lavender change in color. So let's look at the results of our solutions. First we have is fructose. Again, we previously identified that this is a sugar. And as we can see, although we get a color change in fructose, it does not give us the light purple lavender color. Therefore, this is a negative control. Protein is not present in this solution. Our next solution is albumin. Okay. When you think about albumin, I want you to think about egg whites. Egg whites, as we know, is a good source of protein. So as we see with albumin, we see a nice purple color. This is a positive control. This solution has protein in it. Our next solution is cornstarch. Again, we say negative control. No color change for this. It looks still like the original color of the Biorets reagent. Salad oil, again, no purple color, but notice that we got separation. Okay? Remember previously we talked about how we define fats and oils. They are hydrophobic. So the watery part of the solution separated from the non-hydrophilic portion of the solution. So this is salad oil. And then finally, water, which is also a negative control.